Green. This isn't a specific question about any role or a personal one. Uh, are you related in any way to Bruce Campbell? No. <laughs> no? My, my real name is Nicholas Brendan Campbell, but I, I, had to, I had to drop it. Because, you know, it's like, it's like Nicholas Cage is a Coppola. And I just, you know, I didn't want to, I didn't, I didn't want people to think that I was successful because of Bruce's success. No, I'm not, I'm not related to Bruce. Okay, thanks. <laughs> In season seven of Buffy, you had to wear an eye patch for half the end of the season. Uh, was that difficult at all? Yes. <laughs> Try it sometime. Uh, it sucked. I mean, it, it was it was worse when I was in all the, the white bandage. Oh, blue, you know, chip. Sneaky little bastard. Um, when I couldn't, when I had the big bandage on, that sucked because I couldn't take it off. But in between takes, I can just flip that thing up. You, you run into stuff. You know, like back in my, in my, in my drinking days, you know, I would wake up and I would have bruises all over my body and I didn't know what happened. Uh, but with the eye patch, I had bruises all over my body, but I knew what happened. And it's like, well, it's like, shit, damn, who put that there, you know? Fire people left and right because I put a couch there. I didn't really fire anybody. Today. <laughs> What's the most interesting thing you've ever received from a fan? That I've ever received from a fan? Uh, gonorrhea, probably. <laughs> Full blown gonorrhea. Most awkward day on Buffy. Buffy said. Most uh, well, I mean, there's a couple because the, the my first day of working after we were picked up, I, I you know, it was the first thing I'd ever done, so I didn't know how to. I don't know. I didn't know that we had work after lunch, <laughs> and I, we had a pretty big scene that was heavily involving me, and I didn't know my dialogue at all, and I didn't drink a lot of water because I didn't want to hold the production mic going tinkle, so. <laughs> I like passed out and I had to go to my trailer and they're like, who did we hire, you know? And I had to learn lines and I was hyperventilating. Um, I learned how to read a call sheet after that to tell you what work to do. But um, I think that, I think, I think uh, Go Fish, I think the Speedo thing was, was rough for me. Um, I think uh, there was a, a prank that Sarah pulled on me where she, Sorry. during the pack, where she pantsed me and I wasn't wearing underwear that particular day. <laughs> um, and I got the gonorrhea too. It, just, it, 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 just kept, it didn't happen there, but it's a problem. Yeah, hey! Yeah. Hi, this is a Criminal Minds question. Uh -huh. What was it like dating the beautiful Gar Penelope Garcia? It sucks that we have to put it in the past tense, doesn't it? Uh, amazing. I, you know, I just, it's, it's, I love the, you know, and we're not, obviously we're not done, uh, but I loved the chemistry of it, and um, she's really, I mean, Kirsten is, the way that we work together, it's, it, it, it's really, it's a lot of fun. So, but what they're doing now is a lot of fun, too, so it's going to be, it's like I'm going to be in more because we broke it. it, it, it it's, it's, I love it. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, you know, I love Q&As. You know, I'm not, I don't mind talking. I mean, I'm, I'm a decent talker, you know. This is tough today. I'm not gonna lie. Hello, I love you. I love you. <laughs> Thank you. My son is actually partially named after Dr. Par partially? What is it? Okay, here's the thing. Hold on, here's the thing. His name is Alexander, and I wanted to call him Xander, but Daddy is a comic fan, and he wants to call him Lex. <laughs> so, Alexander. Where is Daddy? Stand up, Daddy. <laughs> so what do you call him? Alexander. Because otherwise we'll learn. Okay, that's really long. <laughs> He's gonna pick it. Daddy, stand up. <laughs> You're gonna have to, how old is he? Five months. Okay. Alright, it's not going to really pick it now, but you're going to have to let him to, to pick a shorter name. 
<laughs> at some point. No, but, it's, but it can't be Alex. It's got to be the Lex or Xander. That's right. Or Lexander. Oh. <laughs> I could do that. Lexander. Yeah. Um, my question is. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought... <laughs> Help us name our baby. Okay. <laughs> we have a question. Right. My question is what is your favorite scene in Once More with Feeling? Um. I think, uh, I, well, my favorite, I love the song, um, I Have a Theory. I remember when we were shooting that, like, um, like, I even thinking about it, I get chills, but when we, because, you know, we would, we all recorded it before, and then so we're just kind of... <laughs> See, that's me with two eyes. Can you imagine me with that? Um, so I mean, we were all singing it and stuff, and I remember just like getting chills, you know, and just kind of like walking out the door, you know. Um, and then I, you know, the whole thing, of, there must be witches, some evil witches, which is ridiculous, which they're persecuted. Let me see if I know it. It, it must be witches, some evil witches, which is, which is ridiculous because witches never persecuted. Wicca, good, woman powered, I'll be over here. Bum, bum, bum. Okay. So I guess I was okay in the musical. That's why when I tried to get you guys in clap before, it was nothing. Um, but I also did that one take, which I was shocked because, you know, I was. Very cartoony. It's like you know, I had to pop up a frame and then Sorry. kind of you know go down. And I, and I knew that if I didn't get it on the first take, we were going to be there for hours. So I got it on the first take, and then I tried to do it a second take, and I'm like, well, then we're done. <laughs> so uh, I think that whole thing, and then also the one where I was like, shit. <laughs> All right, we should die. Also the um, the one where. Uh, with the fuck? Like, let it burn, you know, let it burn, yeah, yeah. And walking in the fire engine, like, you know, zooming by. Um, I think the whole thing, to be like, and then my dancing number, and then, like, like, I would, like, I would cry, like, when we were doing it, I would, I would choke up while we're, and I, you know, while we're singing it, you know? And it was just, the whole thing was just magical. That's why when people ask me what my, what my favorite episode was, I'm like, we have to put that episode aside, because that's, an epi you know, that's just, that's that. And then we have the other 141 episodes. Hello again. Hi. Um, since we're at Fan Expo and there's so many amazing costumes and superheroes, I was just wondering, which superhero or villain would you most like to play? You can pick anyone. Superhero or villain? Yes. To, to play? Yes. Excuse me. Um, <laughs> uh, you know, I, no, no, <laughs> I think there was a thing from, uh, Austin Powers, Summers in Rangoon. Winters, we made meat heads. I think Dr. Evil, to be quite honest with you, because I just, that's just where I'm at. Because again, I'm not, I, I wasn't, I, I played a lot of sports as a kid, so I, I, I wasn't, I mean, I met, when I was a kid, Superman was out with Christopher Reeve, and I was telling somebody the story at my uh, table before. Um, but I was eight or nine, and I think the first one had come out, and my dad, was a pilot, you know, a small little plane pilot, and Christopher Reeve, uh, he was a pilot too, and there was a party. And so we went, and there is Christopher Reeve. And I'm eight or nine years old, and I'm like, holy shit, Superman's here, you know? So that was pretty awesome for me, because I didn't know that there wasn't a Superman. So think, you're really needing Superman. That's kind of cool. I shot him. <laughs> I thought that he was faster than me. Um, I, well, things are low. I host a uh, sing-along to Once More With Feeling every year. And <gasps> Come. Um, and this last year we uh, had a contest where we had everyone do the Snoopy dance. Could we see the originator? I always 
always, I, I always end the show with a Snoopy dance so that people who want to take pictures of the Snoopy dance can get ready. Uh, it's, it's really, it's a crowd, please. <laughs> so I will do it at the end, absolutely. Thank you, sir. Thank you for asking. Just wondering if you actually read the uh, Buffy comic books, and if so, do you uh, are agreeing with what, what they're doing with your character in it? I know what's going on with the Buffy comic books because of the wonderful things. Again, I don't read comics. I, I, it's something I started. I, I read one comic as a child. It was before I met Superman, probably seven or eight, and it was it was Archie. Yeah, and I read like two pages. I remember I was camping, and it was I was camping up in the hills above Los Angeles, and it was snowing outside, and we were in a cabin, and it was it was Thanksgiving, and everything was going for it in terms of comfort level, you know. I was upstairs in my bedroom. There was a nice warm light on, snowing outside, which is when you should love reading. And I'm like, and I'm on page two. I'm like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> so I then equated all comics to Archie. I'm like these people are idiots. You know what I mean? So, I started again playing baseball. Does that mean you think they're taking your character in a stupid way then? If you think all comic books are... Wait, say that one time. Well, the Buffy comics, or do you like what they're doing with your character if you know what's going on? I can't, I can't, I can't. Sorry, do you know what's going on with your character? In oh yeah, yeah, I know that, 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 that I'm a Don. That Buffy experiment, experimented with some women, or a woman. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, it was uh, Kennedy? Who? Who? Yes, that one. Um, and I'm kind of in charge. Yeah, I mean, I, I know what's going on, but I don't. But also, Josh said if we were to ever do a movie, it, it, it would, we wouldn't start from where the comments are. We would do, we'd do something different. Thank you. You're welcome. Hi. Hi. I'm just wondering if you have any plans to up your profile on Twitter. Because I noticed your assistant is on there a lot, but I'm wondering if you plan to tweet more in the future, since social media is such a big thing these days. Wait, I... I, I Twitter? Yes, Twitter. Twitter. I twat. <laughs> your assistant is on Twitter a lot, and I'm wondering if you plan to up your profile on Twitter and be on more often. You know, I, 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 I do it from, from time to time, there, um, but I... Honestly, if you guys knew how... Retarded I was when it came to that kind of stuff, you know, I, it's, I'm just not, I'm not, I don't know, I was talking to my writing partner, I'm like, listen, I need help, because my phone here, right, look at my phone, this is, this is an iPhone, and I've got, oh, and this is a business card, that's in the iPhone, um, so I've got all my contacts in here, correct? If I lose this, I'm screwed. So I don't want to back shit up. So I talked to my, uh, to my writing partner, I'm like, can you, I said, I need help. Like, back, back stuff up. She's like, well, yeah, iCloud. I'm like, whatever that is, can you just come and help me? You know, I mean, I'm really, we should thank, thank God, God for Jackie, because I do go on, she set up my whole account. So, you know, so, so I do it. But I really don't, I mean, listen to me. I don't have much to say. And also, I mean, who wants to hear shit from me? You know what I mean? We do. Who the fuck cares what I'm thinking? I mean, really, it's like, oh, I just had a burrito. <laughs> oh, the burrito just came out of my butt. Who cares? You know, like, like to me, it's it's just a bit like people like themselves a little bit too much. You know what I mean? For me personally. But I love you guys. Oh, we should look. You're here right now. We're, we're making actually said contact. <laughs> Isn't this the way it should be? <laughs> Say it again. Uh, sorry, the people can were come to my house anytime when we can make contact. <laughs> You can come stay at my house anytime and we can make contact. <laughs> when your leg gets better, tweet me.